SonicQ is usually distributed as a downloadable zip archive organized in two folders plus three additional files. There's a demo projects folder, a firmware folder, an important release notes and readme file, the Omnio firmware upload tool bundle installation file, and the SonicQ installation file. The firmware folder contains compatible firmware and readme files for every device supported by a specific SonicQ release. In addition, SonicQ offers a firmware database for updates that are issued independently from SonicQ releases. This is the fastest way to distribute new firmware in between full software releases. For Omnio devices, you install new firmware with the Omnio Firmware Upload Tool. Firmware for L and C series amplifiers, which are not Omnio devices, can be updated directly in SonicQ. Before you try to install software or update firmware, you need to make sure you have admin rights on your PC. Extract the contents of the SonicQ zip folder. In the example, it's extracted to the desktop. As an alternative to the SonicQ release packages, you can use the Update Check feature to get the latest firmware files. Before you check for updates, make sure you're connected to the internet. Go to File, Settings, and click Check for Updates. The SonicQ Firmware Updates page opens in your web browser. It lists the latest firmware files for every device supported by SonicQ. Click Select Firmware Version. Select a file and then click the download firmware.msi link. Save the file, and then click the downloads button of your web browser to view the progress. Minimize the web browser window, click the downloads button again, and then drag the downloaded firmware file to your desktop. You can close the web browser now. Before you can update the firmware on an Omnio device, you need to install the Firmware Upload Tool. Open the folder that includes the Firmware Upload Tool installation file. In this case, that would be the SonicQ 1.2.0 release package. Double-click the file named Setup Omnio Firmware Upload Tool Bundle to open the setup tool. Click Install to start the installation. Click Next, accept the end user license agreement, click Next again, then Install, and finally Finish. When the installer reports Setup Successful, click Close, then close the File Explorer window. Next you'll see how to install an MSI firmware file to your PC. Double-click the mxefirmware.msi file to start the installation tool. Click the Next button, then check the I accept the terms in the license agreement checkbox, click the Next button again, and start the installation. This will install all the necessary files in the correct locations on your PC. Finally, click Finish. Next, I'll show you how to update device firmware using the Omnio Firmware Upload Tool. Before starting, make certain that you have admin rights on your PC and that you are in the same IP address range as the device or devices you want to update. If you install the MSI file, the firmware is already in the correct folder for the Firmware Update tool to find it. By default, Dante and Omnio devices choose their IP addresses automatically from the 169.254 range. If you set your PC to obtain IP addresses automatically, it will do the same. Now open the Omnio Firmware Upload tool. 
Select the device you want to update. Click Upload. Select the firmware you want to upload and click Start. Depending on the size of the firmware file, the whole process can take as long as five minutes. But you won't have to wait that long. For this example, we'll speed things up and skip to the end of the process. As soon as the state changes to finished, you can close the Omnio firmware upload tool. And you're done.